Luke chapter 2, verses 1 to 15. Luke chapter 2, verses 1 to 15. In those days, a decree went out from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be registered. This was the first registration when Quirinius was governor of Syria, and all went to be registered, each to his own town. And Joseph also went up from Galilee, from the town of Nazareth, to, to Judea, to the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the house and lineage of David, to be registered with Mary, his betrothed, who was with child. And while they were there, the time came for her to give birth, and she gave birth to her firstborn son, and wrapped him in swaddling cloths, and laid him in a manger, because there was no place for them in the inn. And in the same region, there were shepherds out in the field, keeping watch over their flock by night. And an angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were filled with great fear. And the angel said to them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good news of great joy that will be for all the people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, who is Christ the Lord. And this will be a sign for you. You will find a baby wrapped in swaddling cloths and lying in a manger. And suddenly there was the angel, a multitude of the heavenly hosts praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace among those with whom he is pleased. When the angels went away from them into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, Let us go over to Bethlehem and see this thing that has happened, which the Lord has made known to us. Angels we have heard on high Sweetly singing of the plains and the mountains sing reply, echoing their joyous strains. Gloria in excelsis. Mary, Joseph, 
Joseph lingering, while our hearts in love embrace.
Our dear Heavenly Father, as we come together to worship you, may you unite our hearts and our minds in Christ Jesus. Even though right now distance may have separated us, this coronavirus may have scared most of us, and the statistics of this pandemic has been spiraling, O oh Lord, yet Teach us to trust in you. Teach us to follow you and learn to walk with you, Lord, every step of the way. Though there may be uncertainties of the future, yet we know, O oh Father, that you are sovereign, you are mighty, and that towards your people, towards your children, O oh God, that you continue to show your grace and your mercy. And your compassions are new every morning. Oh, Father, help us that we may continue to let your word instruct us, comfort us, inspire us. Lord, so many people are suffering out there. And they need the message of hope. They need to realize, oh God, that you are the source of all blessings. Hence, even in spite of the trimmings, of the Christmas trees, of the carols, that, or of the parties that may prevail during this season, Lord, help us that we may anchor our soul upon Thee, O God, that we may continually focus our eyes on Jesus. He may be the babe 2,000 years ago, yet he is the king, our coming king. Hence, Father, may we see our glorious Savior, our majestic Redeemer. May we behold him, O God. Not just because of this Sunday, but because of what you are doing, O Lord, in our lives. Oh, Father, some of us may be weak right now, may be tired or exhausted, exasperated even by the pandemic. Some of our senior citizens, oh Lord, yearn to go out and smell the fresh air, and yet they are limited, oh Lord, with their movement. Our children, our students are also stressed out along with the teachers by this online education. Yet, Father, help us, help them, O oh Lord, that they will be sustained by your grace and that they will persevere through this tribulation. Help them, Father, that 
the students will continue to learn and that they will not be distracted, that they will make good use of the time, O oh Father. At this, in the same token, dear Lord, help them to realize that you are there. Lord, help our students to see that you are the sovereign God who even rules in this pandemic. Lord, abide with us. Abide with, your bro with our brothers and sisters that as we tarry, as we endure through this period, we will let your word be our strength. May you be our ever-present help in times of trouble, our refuge, and our shield. Lord, right now, as we listen to your word, may your message, O Father, be ingrained in our lives. May we learn from all the comfort that we receive to use them to minister to others, to comfort people around us. Thank you, O Lord. In Christ's name we pray. Amen. Sulay hati tibe pingan. Peace to you, brothers and sisters in Christ. Nan tilibe kiet sok tige ng siyang di chap ni lo. We're about to conclude the year 2020. Tige ng siyang di chap ni si kai si e si chul no. When the year 2020 started, jin soy lang chul kam kap jin sui jin umbang. People appro uh people regarded it with so much hope and expectation. Kan si kau kinadit. But today. The whole world has been disappointed with the, with the year 2020. Because of the huge pandemic, because of COVID-19, there, there were so many infections and many deaths. Therefore, people feel, felt that this year has not been stable. Tige ang bundi tiyan Merriam Webster o iu yung tidi di o lai cheng ho kong se tige nang cheng di chap ni zui xiong yung e di. The Merriam Webster Dictionary has um, dubbed one word as the most often used word of the year. To si hidi di pandemic tua diu hien. The word pandemic. Tui dan ki tok to lai kong ni u xiami cha ma Kini? For us as Christians, were there any difference? Si si siyong e bo si mi cha. In fact, not much difference. Sige sing kwan pin ito ko as si iyang hiyong tiyo dan kitok to. COVID-19 has also inf uh, impacted a lot of us Christians. Kong kya tiyo mwa diyao jin zwe sin to e sim. Fear has penetrated the hearts of many Christians. Nan nya ku kui ui, kiang diak kao, u chin lang peng iu, a lot of us have also families or friends who have been infected or worse, have even died. Churches, up until now, churches have not been able to gather together and worship in physical form. Um, the COVID-19 threat is still ever present. The fear of COVID-19 is also ever present. Where can we find relief? In 2 Corinthians chapter 1 verses 3 to 4. In 2 Guan 
In 2 Corinthians chapter 1, verses 3 to 4, it reads, Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of mercies and God of all comfort, who comforts us in all our affliction so that we may be able to comfort those who are in any affliction with the comfort with which we ourselves are comforted by God. Let us pray. Banyang e pe gune shong te gune kiu tsu sui dian di si banyang e kang si gun a si kinadit kwa tiyo kong se di si kwa tsu ai e ti pe kwa nang kwa tak kwa e an ui e shong te tsu a sui dian gun si maya li tu tiyo tsu ai kwa nan si ge bing tok tsin tsu e Sin bo hong pien e so zai. Tan si zu a. Tan guan di to gun e ao kwa tiyo. Tok tok zi u di. E ton to gun u jeng siak e bieng an. Tok tok zi u di gun za u hanang mbang kao gun e jong lai. Tok tok zi u di. E tang in chua gun toke itse e tong ko. Itse e bun tue. Itse e chi dien. บอกว่าสิมิเจียงเหียงมุนใจยาดีเอียงกับบุญตรงใจเอียงเจ้าขอบุญเอียงขวางขอบุญกำเสียดีขอเถิดจู่ยาโซกิตกันเนี่ยอาเมนตัวเจ้าดังโซกงเอกิวเจ um a while ago we mentioned relief เจ้าบอกใจดีเชียมจำอาศัยอีสัง relief is not found in any doctors or vaccines นั่นเอาของเขาเชียมจำ Bo itiang it si ho e ma. Vaccines may not necessarily be good. U si zon u hu zok yong. Sometimes they have their own side effects. So then we gong say ah tang kau ika kak tiang e si zon then sabi cham cham. We may say that we'll just wait a little bit longer until it's more stable before we take the vaccine. Kan si dambe tlo e tang tip tiyo ani kwan e po ziong. But where or when will we get the assurance or the guarantee? Na chige cham cham. Cimaya asi au mai. That this vaccine, whether now or later in the future, one zuan tadan ho se. Will be able to 100% eradicate and cure us. So be kong se sige cham cham si dani kiu se yo. Therefore, if we claim that the vaccine will be our relief, then ko ko ding ikwa di kong se bo iting o. We can say that not really. Then I can call Eason me. How about doctors? We can say, oh, then to chase me Eason, I see to chase me Eguan. People will tell us, oh, you should try this doctor or go to this hospital. Yeah, si bo po tiyong. There's no guarantee. Yung ikini, then kwa tiyo kong say, jin zwe Eason, jin zwe ho su, o asi ki tuan diam tiyo, uwe asi si ki. Because we can see, we have seen that throughout this year, many doctors, nurses, health professionals have not been exempt from this infection. And some... So, then, Cheng Siak Kong Kila Eo, then is Su Yao, then Su Yao E Kiu Tse. Therefore, we can say that what we really need as our relief Tok Tok Ti Ki Tok Lai is to be found solely in Christ Jesus. Ti Dan Kinadit Tsai Ki E Kiang Bun In our Bible passage for this morning, Paul Loli Kadan Kong Paul told us, Siong te si Kyo Tsui Papa. God is our Abba Father. Dan Ti Tiang E Papa. Our Heavenly Father. Di Tia Isi Dan Kyo Tsu Tsu Yaso E Papa. In fact, He is the Father of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Ku Chin Tsu Bi Yodin Na Kwa Te Sa Zat Igong Se, Chiu Si Hwa Tsu Bi E Papa, Su Tak Yung E Siong Te. In fact, we can see in verse 3, he is the Father, God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of mercies and God of all comfort. What a loving Father we have. Throughout the scripture, it has been recorded. God's people have special um, experiences with God. With your Hyong Siu Dan Tiki Tok Lai. In order to enjoy 
um, our being in Christ Jesus, we have this special bond. Because of this, because of this, we have the special right and the special privilege to be able to call God our Abba Father. This um, idea of calling God our Abba Father it was actually revealed to us by His Son, Jesus Christ. In the Lord's Prayer, in the Lord's Prayer, we remember, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. So, Therefore, when we look at the, the start of the Lord's Prayer, Our, heavenly, our Father, who art in heaven, Jesus was teaching us that we should call this God our Abba Father, our Heavenly Father because we are related to Him. In Christ Jesus, we have a relationship with this God. Uh, God uh, Jesus' disciple, John understands this idea. Therefore, he said, John the Apostle tells us, to all who did receive him, who believed in his name, he gave the right to become children of God. It's found in John chapter 1, verse 12. In Christ Jesus, we are God's children. We know that God is a God who loves us. So did he sudan did it so su yao emikia. Therefore he provides for our daily needs. Isi hoe. He is a good God. Mwa utsu ai boxia. He is um a merciful uh, shepherd. E chin chin tit chin bit tit ho tiao dan. He calls us uh deeply and intimately. Mbang dan e tang yong siu yi. He wants us to enjoy him. He wants us to walk with him forever. Let us reflect once again on verses 3 and 4. We can see that God is the God who cares about us. Um, all the pains. Trials, fears, and tribulations, He will be with us every step of the way. Some people may claim that God is the source of all these problems. That all these tribulations, these problems, People claim that God is the cause of all these problems. He's the one who gave these problems to us. But for us as Christians, we are very clear about this. He is the God who gives all comfort. Based on what we know, Based on what we know, that God is our ever-present help in times of trouble. He is our refuge. So, as His children, He's telling us, He's He said, cast all your cares upon Him. Uh, because he cares for us. That's found in First Peter chapter five verse seven. 
。所以，咱去看哦，在咱今仔日这个经文。In our Bible passage for today， 保罗在透这个书信，和哥林多的教会。In the first epistle or letter that Paul sent to the Corinthian Christians, he rebuked them. He rebuked them. 关于教会内面所发生的罪及混党混派 Paul、um, rebuked them for the sinfulness and divisiveness inside the church. So Paul rebuked them. Um, uh, Paul disciplined them. He out in what? Ah, in he out in what? No. Later on, they realized it. In what what cacao in Zion, shong liao ti pe e sim. These Corinthian Christians realize how they have grieved God. Zion shong to ya so ki tok shong sim. They realize how they have grieved Jesus Christ. Ya Zion to xian lian shong sim. They realize how they have grieved the Holy Spirit. 简单讲哦，因所做诶代志，托上帝无欢喜。Simply put, what they have done have displeased God. In what can go in again? Pian di shong de jin heng. They realize that they have strayed away, so far away from God. In ju hui gai. Therefore, they repented. Guat zi de sun hok shong de. They have decided and determined to serve God. Yi ao in a tai do ju gui jing eng shong de. Their attitudes from then on have been turned towards God. In tin tio po lo e ga si. Based on Paul's teachings, 一步一步归正恩上帝。They took the necessary steps to turn to turn themselves back right to God. 这个一百八十度的改变。This 180 degree change. 保罗，使徒保罗有看到。Um, the apostle Paul, uh, uh, was aware of it. 除非这个保罗也看到。Aside from this. Paul also noticed. Corinto 教会经历真侪问题。Paul also noticed that the Corinthian church have experienced a lot. So did Paul also share this third epistle to Corinto 教会来安慰因 Therefore, Paul wrote the second epistle to comfort the Christians there. 教圣，保罗要用家己的话来劝因 Paul could have used his own words to comfort them. 但是哦，保罗就是指着天卑，独独是天卑才通安慰因。But Paul pointed out that it is only God and God alone who can comfort them. 都都着因在所有问题。As they face all these various trials. 都只有天卑的安慰才有可能帮助因。He pointed out that only God alone can help them and comfort them. 既然上帝是啊、呃，这个达苏达样的安慰的上帝。Since God is the God of all comfort， 伊咧甲咱讲 ，He is telling us， 无论什么试炼 ，No matter the tribulation， 无论什么患难 ，No matter the um troubles， troubles， 无论什么悲哀 ，No matter the um mourning， 啊是什么？ Okay. Or suffering, persecution. He is still with us. He is still with us. He is with his people. 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 He is with God is with us. His word will become our greatest comfort. His grace will be sufficient for us. His love and mercy will become our good news. You know, just before Jesus came, Israelite God, as he do to us in so many ways, the Israelites have been through so much trouble. In that season, the Romans they were persecuted. They were persecuted. They were controlled or ruled by the Romans. But in this big trouble, but 
However, in the midst of all this big problem, God came among them. God came as man among them. So the angels came and announced to all the shepherds uh, the good news that has come upon them. Our loving God. The God who can come who is the God of all comforts. It is clearly written that no problem um, whatever the, the suffering whatever the sin whatever the pain none of these will be able to deter us from God's comfort. God's comfort is still able to comfort us. In fact, this comfort it's a very special comfort. Because when God gives it to us He gives it to us in a very personal way. Even though you and I have read the same Bible verse However, my experience will be different from how you experience God's comfort. Therefore, we can see how this awesome God is able to convey His message to each one of us. Therefore, we can see that His comfort will reach us at the right time. He is really a good counselor. He is truly the Prince of Peace. In John chapter... Uh, 16 verse 33 it said there in this world you will have tribulations of every kind but be of good cheer for I have overcome the world truly he has overcome the world Around us, people might tell us, you're going through this problem. Don't worry because God knows that you can overcome this. God knows you can overcome and solve this problem. That's why He's giving this to you. Is this true? Like God. The people who who claim these things actually they don't know God. Because if you know the true and living God, we will know that we ourselves we are unable to conquer sin. How will we be able to overcome all these trials and tribulations? How will we be able to overcome all these problems? So Therefore, for us as believers, we have discovered it is, it is not I who is able but he is able he is able so msi pintyo dieng liak asi kwan ping na isi pintyo siang dieng it is not by might nor by power but by the spirit of the lord 
So, sulay hiya ti tibe. Therefore, brothers and sisters, kiniyo suiden si tigetin tamen ni. Even though this year has been horrific, kan si tuidan kitok to lai kong. But for us as Christians, dan yung kai tu kwake soy buntoy. We need to look past all these problems. Dan yung kai tu kwante o dan si wikiu tu. We need to look to our Savior. Dan yung kai tu kwante o dan si wikiu siyong teo bo pang sakdan. We need to look to the God who has never abandoned us. Ya bo hong ki dan. He has never um he has never forsaken us. I ke shok lai ho tiao dan. He still calls us. Lai kyo dan titio i wei gu. He calls us to uh to hear his word, to receive his word. Lai titio i e kasi. To receive his teaching and instruction. Mang dan e zuan hui kao i e bin ceng. Desiring for us to turn back to him. So tit i e wei gu zai tang an wei dan. So that his word may be able to comfort us. So that he may go to our home and book young then. So that his word may be able to lead us. Sweden, this is a guy who is saying, "Si ubuntu ay tinsoy tongko." Even though there is, there are lots of problems and pains and sufferings in this world. Shong teo, boy kong se chong todan o bo. God did not promise that He would exempt us or or shield us from these problems. Then the question can it try bin one bin but when we look through the Bible, yok piak lo a piak de pan lo try so question can it we din lo in long u can de kau bun tu e tong ko throughout Scripture we can read the accounts of Job. Abraham and many other great men of, and women of faith, they have they have been through painful and terrible sufferings too. Yaso ebunto kap choki kau hoy yasikeng diak kau pipiak. Jesus's disciples and the early Christ early Christians have also been uh, through so much persecution. In asikeng kets in soy tongko. They have also been through so much pain and suffering. So did didan kinadit. Nangko kwaay ge tego sa to. Therefore, today look when we look at verse five. Nangki den so e shootio kitok e koto, so ko kitok so e tip an ui. For as we share abundantly in Christ's sufferings, so through Christ we share abundantly in comfort too. So, dan to si uhan ang yong shoot ko kitok. We can enjoy Christ. Potanti. Whether in good times, the bunto e si tun dan asi uha ng kiang dia kau kitok. We can still enjoy Christ even though we have problems. The book ceng sige sa dige o. Right now in December, dan e se kai. The whole world. I ko ding ay kong se oh in wind dan Sweden tu tio sige sin kuan pintok. Maybe the world sees that. Since we've been through so much from uh, with the COVID nineteen, then to like huang huang hi hi ze. Ah, let us be festive. Then like kien chok ze. Let's celebrate. Then like ah chong zui bun zui o pang sak. Let us forget these problems. Then si o ni kua o in so kong e ze ge an ui go le o si jiam chai. But if you look at it, the the relief that they offer is but temporary. So dan tu siang din, dan tu kau, cege an ui bo cai ti kong u siang tan chiu. Therefore, we can see that our relief or comfort is not from from seeing a Christmas tree. Asi cai ti sumi poti siang tan e poti. Or from a beautiful Christmas decorations. Asi kong oh lai po ka in. Or that we can have some caroling. Asi kong se ah u eso cai li pak boi. Oh, or that there may be sales. Then, eh, so I, so I, in the Kong, eh, and we, so I say, guy, and we, oh, sit down, chai. All these um comforts and reliefs are just temporary. Yo, die hua hi ya. Yes, you may be delighted. Then, si kau dit lo e si tono di ya. Then you want it? What kapio? Sige buntu e you want sun sai. However, at the end of the day, we will realize that the problem is still there. Dan si dan e an ui, dan sin to e an ui. However, 
we as Christians are comfort. It's found in Christ alone. Our comfort is found only in this merciful God. It is found only in the God of all comfort. So Therefore, in uh, throughout December, as it, or even in the next two, next few months, then say you like, uh, how do we show that um, we have a different sense of comfort from the world? To see to get the day seeds that is found in verse four. They see that to see come. Verse 4 reads, So that we may be able to comfort those who are in any affliction with the comfort with which we ourselves are comforted by God. Nan Tanya we know that the world is suffering. The world is going through so much troubles. In so, let's say We know that the comfort that they seek is also temporary. In fact, the comfort that they seek falls short of God's glory. They would not last. So Therefore, brothers and sisters in Christ, Dan We need to come and know the God of all comforts. Dan we need to know more that he is a God of God who is gracious and compassionate. We, have, we need to also come to enjoy and realize that his mercy is new every day. So with the comfort that we have received. Now we are able to go and comfort others. The people around us, our friends and relatives, maybe they don't even they haven't come to know this comfort. Maybe they still don't know this living God. Maybe they didn't even know why Jesus came. But you know, you have experienced His saving grace. You have experienced His comfort. You have experienced His love. You have experienced His word. So Therefore, brothers and sisters, this is the most suitable time for, for us to help them to come and receive this word. With what comfort you have received, go and comfort them. We should not say that, oh no, I'm not a pastor, I'm not a missionary, I cannot do this, I cannot talk, I'm not very eloquent. Let someone else do it. Oh, so then to We come up with excuses claiming that we can't do it. But since we have experienced Him, let us go and comfort others. Verse 5 
上帝所赐的安慰，去安慰遐拄着呃达款患难的人。He comforts us in all our affliction, so that we may be able to comfort those who are in any affliction with the comfort with which we ourselves are comforted by God. So, pinto. 咱所经对主来经历的这个安慰哦。With the comfort that we have experienced from God， 这个是最最好的经验，来去鼓励别人。This is the best experience with which to encourage others。并着咱所经历的安慰。With what with the comfort that we have experienced， 咱有法能托人知影，原来咱所信的上帝是够真够话的。We can share。To other people about how the God that we believe in is indeed the true and living God. So, um, bang dam bang, jong cik sin siap keng le, keng le na. Therefore, please don't just hide the faith. Asi keng ke cik pai di dia atau buat kiri le. Let's not forget it just after a Sunday worship. Um, bang dam ho ho lai, ah, hak sip cik keng bun. May we study and learn this passage carefully. Ho ho bim piak cik sin siap. Understand this passage carefully. Ho ho, like he, pin to your shongte and we, and we panang. That we may go and comfort others with the comfort we have received from God. Mang dan ung huan ang to in hege ki hue o, like ku chong hian kau ti ui kiu zu. May we give them the opportunity to behold this Savior. In zai kuan tiu, ui xiami ilai. That they may see why he came. Mang di situ ye lang, uha nang chong hen kau di so keng dia ke ping an an ui. May the people around you behold the the peace and comfort that you have experienced in him. Ya, mang o, nang so chong hen, nang chong hen e ti ui kiu zu o, um si hege siang tan e ge e ya. May we also be, may we also behold the that the Christ Jesus that we know is is not just a baby in in the in the Christmas story. Nice, he's a wee kun ong, kut kutjong kwan e kun ong. He did not remain a baby, but he is now the king, the powerful king who reigns. He itedly hold out to the sky, like a soul lang like kui ong. He is the king who is calling to the whole world for people to come to him. So the two and by then the cha cha the hege so zai. Therefore, God has placed us at this right place and time. Tang dan wu huan ang jiao dan e qin lang peng you. That we may invite our friends, our relatives. Jiong hen kao zi wei kun ong. That they may also behold this reigning God. Zai ya zi wei kun ong si be ku lai lo. That they may also know that this King is the coming King. So, ye kai si tu si cimaya, cige anui. And this starts from the comfort that we can find in Him. Wan su, ah, titio yang yau. May God be glorified. Amen. Amen. Kam sya tu. Jesus came into the world to bring us the free gift of salvation. Without Christ, we would all die from our sins. Let us all offer our praises to Him for all the love that He has done for all of us. Behold, a virgin shall be with child and shall bring forth a son, and they shall call his name Emmanuel, which being interpreted is God with us.
Jesus is our hope, our Savior who shines through the darkness. It is time for us to celebrate His birth once again. For unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given, and the government will be upon His shoulders, and His name will be called Wonderful, Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, and the Prince of Peace. As this song says, what can we give to Christ? We are to give our hearts to Jesus. God loves you and cares for you. He gave his one and only begotten Son to pave the way for you and me. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life.
May our hearts be filled with peace as we commemorate our Savior's birth. May we find hope from the one above, despite all the trials and challenges encountered from this year's pandemic. May the God of hope fill you with all the joy and peace as you trust in Him, so that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. Therefore, my beloved brothers and sisters, be steadfast, immovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord, knowing that in the Lord your labor is not in vain. And now, may the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make His face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. May the Lord lift up His countenance upon you and give you peace. 
until Christ comes. Amen. Our